where are all the good men? All the good men are everywhere, all over the place. It's incredible. Women ask this question. So let me translate what they really mean. Where are the eight, nine, and 10 men that I'm sexually attracted to that make my little kitty tingle? Where are they that actually want me? That is a very different question because depending on where you are on the 10 scale, you're gonna pretty much get commensurate with where you are. Let's just go with that. Yes, men above your station, above your rating, will have sex with you, sure. But that's gonna be it, it's gonna be empty, and gonna be bitter and alone. And women, they try the whole 304 thing. It does not, not really work out for women. So, let's say that you realize, okay, these men that are at the top tier, they're not checking for me in a serious way. So go down in looks in terms of women. Women shouldn't be choosing men the way men choose women anyway. Women should be about security, provision. That's what women should focus on, security and provision. And is he a good dude? Does he have decent character? Will he take care of you? Will he take care of his family? That's what women used to look for. The pretty boy thing, they, they were great, they were exciting, they were fun, but women who had sense didn't really choose that way. Anyway, let's, let's go back. And for real, what difference does it make if you're attracted to them or not anyway? After about the first five years of marriage, the sex dries up anyway, so you're not having sex anymore, you don't have that obligation, you're not sexually attractive, attracted, excuse me, and you're no longer having sex. Then five years in, women typically get fat, and so you're not even as sexually attractive as you were from the start. So you've really lost a lot of your own leverage. So let's say that this man cheats on you. Well, you should think that's a good thing because that removes any and all obligation you had towards sex. So women, if the eight nines and tens are not really being serious about you, you're just a bust down for them, and you're tired of that, you need to seriously evaluate where you are in terms of your looks and get within that level. But most of all, get a man that has provision, get a man that offers protection, get a good dude who's interested in being there for you. Get the one that wants to get you. That's how you win.